Hi there, folks. My name is Paul Bars from paulbars.com and maximumsuccessuniversity.com. Thank you so much for taking the time to come and join with me in this series of video tutorials working with WordPress. Now, this is the very first of these, and what I'm going to be doing is taking a brand new website, paulbars.net, which I've registered purely for demonstration purposes to show you how easy it is to install, configure, and build websites with WordPress and then monetize them and actually create cash from what we're doing. I'm just going to start here in the cPanel control section. And of course, if you don't have access to a cPanel with your current website host, I suggest you ditch that host, get yourself a new one. You'll see links at the bottom of paulbars.com and paulbars.net that will give you some information on where you can find good hosting. But very simply, I'm going to show you one of the easier ways to install WordPress using this control panel. I'm going to come down near towards the bottom to the Fantastico Deluxe section. Here I have a whole bunch of different options. I don't need them all. I just want this one here, WordPress. Currently it tells me that I have no installation. Yeah, I kind of know that already. So we want to do a new installation, which is clicking this one just here. It's going to ask me for some details. Yes, this is where I want. Uh, I just want it to leave into the normal public HTML, which is a leave, uh, uh, leave empty to install there. Yep, that's fine. I'm going to need to put in some uh, username, data, account nickname, password, and so on. So let's do that. And I'll start with, well, this is all about WordPress tutorials. So how about uh, administrator username? This is the uh, for the password protected area. This is... I think I might have to blur this one out actually, so I'm going to do that in just one moment. And then of course the password here. Now I wanted to show you very quickly up the top a very cool little website. It's called Strong Password Generator. And here at Strong Password Generator, I can generate a password on a whole bunch of different sort of recommendations by clicking this link. Notice the password coming up down here. This is where I generate my passwords, including symbols or without. Very quick, very, very easy. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. And then I'm going to put that information into here. Obviously, I have to blur it out during that particular time. Come back and then we'll do the account nickname details as well, which is what people see on the live end. So let me just pause for one moment. Back with you in just a second. And so we're back here. You can see, obviously, I've blurred these out. No need for you to know what my username and password are to log in. But I will tell you now, when it comes to your username for login, don't make it admin or admin1 or admin2 or admin anything because that's the default with some automatic installers. And that's a great one for the hackers and crackers to play with to get hold of your stuff. So now we moved on to the nickname. This is what people are going to actually see. I'm going to use a keyword here, WordPress Video Tutorials, and I suggest you do the same for your website as well. The admin email address, very simply, paul at paulbars.com. That's my public address, so I can show that one to you. The site name, uh, let's call it the same here, actually. We'll call it uh, WordPress Video Tutorials. And the description, free WordPress Video Tutorials. Learn WordPress the easy way. That'll do. We can change all that later. Go and install WordPress. Let's see how we go. Okay, and we're done. Well, almost done. Tells me it's going to create a new MySQL database. Good. I don't like personally working with databases. It's going to go here. It's going to go there. And we're going to click Finish Installation and make the whole thing happen. Beautiful. Now, as you can see, I've got some areas blurred out again. That's the uh, the password details, of course. But uh, it tells us everything's been done, everything has been installed. Let's go to a new window and have a quick look. Ah, oh, starting to take shape. If I move the window around, this is the default, uh, what's called the 2010 um, theme, but we'll be changing that along the way. WordPress video tutorials, yeah, coming down. 
Very good. Okay, so we can see there's some little extra bits and pieces there. But it's a beginning where we can actually now start doing stuff. And you can see where I've got the description. Hey, look, it's coming over there as well. Sweet. So that's the rest. That's the end of this particular video. Next one, we'll log into our admin panel and we'll start getting some things done. Talk to you then. Bye-bye.